Andrew Guyant with Simply Vegas and I have a brand new listing here behind me today. This home just hit the market, built in 2002. We're out here in Sun City Anthem. This home's a single story home. It's gonna be 2,352 square feet, three bedroom, four bath, and it does have that wonderful casita. We also have a golf cart garage, a beautiful pool out back, open floor plan. There's so much to see. Follow me, we're gonna go inside and take a look, find out if this is the right home for you. Let's go. All right, everyone, 799999. 2,352 square feet plus the casita. Single story, two car garage. You can see the golf cart garage here. Great curb appeal. We're up here in Sun City Anthem. This is gonna be 2780 Fort Myer Avenue. We are in 89052. The home's been on the market just a few days now. Take a look around the neighborhood here. And yeah, just Sun City Anthem, built in 2002. Take a quick look down the side of the lot here. All right, so one of the features I really love about this home, uh, outside of this golf cart garage, which we'll check out later on, so stay tuned. But it's this big door gate uh, situation here. Check this thing out, so security, function looks great just a massive door it's 10 feet tall and uh and the other thing i love about this door which you don't see a lot because you do see these doors occasionally you don't see them with the professional stopper down there so you aren't hitting your house that's a great feature so i do like that this home's been very well maintained you can see a nice archway very tall entrance as we walk in and this is gonna be your courtyard. Nice open private space here. This is gonna be the front entrance to the home. Lots of front facing windows. And then the casita is gonna be back here. The casita and that golf cart garage. We'll be over to those in just a moment. This is gonna be a door going into one of the bedrooms. So just so much function, so much uh, uh, connectivity in this home. Everything's separated, but it all kind of comes back together in the middle here. Big double door entryway. And again, the main home here is 2,352 square feet. So you can see a nice open floor plan. And the main areas are gonna have the 20 inch uh, rustic looking dark tile there. And then this laminate wood plank flooring. We do have the gas fireplace here with some of that same tile and a smaller version. Again, very clean and a wet bar here as well. So if you're looking for a wet bar, you found it. I'm gonna give you a quick peek of the pool, but not too much. Formal dining room, little pass-through entrance into the kitchen. I love the light there. The curtains look very nice. When you see a home like this and there's, you know, some furniture, some curtains, window coverings, things like this, there's a clock there. When you see a home like this, uh, it's pretty obvious that it wasn't staged. This is just stuff they didn't take with them. They probably don't want it. It's why it's here most likely. They moved out and they just left these things here. Um, in my opinion, I would go with less chairs on that table. As a staging look, I would just do four. But it, what I'm trying to say is I think everything that's in the house is gonna come with the house. So when you see things like this and they just left behind, they're pretty much just leaving it for the new owner. We do have a powder room. So it is four bathrooms. There's gonna be three full baths, which we'll check out. And then this half bath here. And that's right next to the office. So that is gonna be your guest bath for, the bath for the home. Beautiful little office here, open. will definitely do the trick. Not too big, but you know, you don't need a whole lot of space for an office. And that brings us back to the bedroom. So we saw the door from the courtyard coming in. So that's gonna be that door right there. And this is a good sized bedroom. We have a 15 by 13 bedroom here. I love the ceiling fan look. And this, Bedroom has its own full bath. And again, 2003. You get a mix of different uh, time periods here in this home. Some of the 
finishes are newer. Some of them are a little bit older or original. This carpet is wonderful. I really like the carpet they used. Closet to the left into the separate laundry room, dedicated laundry room. We have Samsung washer and dryer, top loader on the washer. And those seem to be fairly new uh, and fairly clean, actually very clean. And then a really nice big sink here, plenty of storage. And then they did put a bar across there for hanging clothes too. And then these, which I'm sure they hang clothes on as well, these, you know, coat hooks here. Uh, the garage is to my right. It is a two car garage. They're currently changing the water heater. So it's kind of a disaster out there. I'm not even gonna show you, but it is a two car garage and it will have a brand new water heater. Okay, so when we come in the house and we make an immediate left, this is gonna take us to the primary bedroom. Again, that really, really nice uh, low pile carpet. I do like the carpet a lot. It feels great. There's a nice pad. And this is gonna be the primary bedroom. 30 by 14, massive primary bedroom. Plenty of space here. And then you do have this big slider going out to that courtyard as well. Same ceiling fan. And we do have 10 foot ceilings in this home as well. Couple windows out back and that brings us into this large primary bathroom. So we do have the water closet here with the door for privacy. And then we have the shower enclosure here. Again, super duper clean. I mean, just very, very clean. And again, I don't think those doors are 2003. I don't even know if this whole enclosure is 2003, but it might be. It's hard to say. It definitely could be. It's just very clean. Yeah, based on these counters, I'm sure it's all 2003. But yeah, those doors, everything's just very clean and well kept. So it's, it's a little surprising that it's that clean. Did anyone live here? <laughs> all right. Big walk-in closet there as well. You have your double vanity here. So yeah, primary bathroom, primary bedroom. And we're just getting through this thing. So, you know, these single stories, yeah, it is, you know, about 2,700 square feet total, but you know, single story, it's easy cruising around, which is why these are so great for, you know, people looking to retire, no stairs. Okay, so we'll sneak around to the kitchen on this side. I wanted to give you this view here. So you can see right away we have stainless appliances. We have GE profile stainless microwave and stove. And those seem to be a little newer. We have a Wolf gas range here with the lure hood, all in stainless steel as well. Original cabinets, but these are high quality cabinets. So you can always look in here and make sure that they have the high quality hinges. Um, not soft clothes, but hey, you know, 2003. I do love the backsplash. It's kind of sneaky here. I almost didn't even notice it. Really great backsplash. Um, more modern than the rest of the house. Like I said, I almost didn't even notice it. Now that I did, that's really, really nice. Might be my favorite feature of the kitchen is that backsplash. Excellent. Big window looking out. White sink. You have your GE dishwasher there. And this island is actually oversized for this kitchen, which is great. Not oversized in a weird way, but oversized in a, in a nice way, meaning you have plenty of room here to work, prep space, and then you also have a nice countertop uh, for seating for dining. So, And then you have what appears to be a newer GE profile fridge as well. Not new, but newer. And it has this uh, slate kind of finish to it. Not exactly stainless it's that new matte finish that we like that i haven't learned the color name of but yeah that's your beautiful kitchen with this nice dining nook here and that's a big table with a lot of chairs for that area um, a little overkill in my opinion but again that's just a table not the house great space you have the bay window here yeah so that's going to be your kitchen we're going to go check out this pool now, and then we're going to be headed over to that casita and that golf cart garage. So stay with me. Let's check this out. I'm Andrew Guyant with Simply Vegas. Um, I did want to give you some, uh, some notes on Sun City Anthem. Uh, I do sell out of here. I sell homes specifically in Sun City Anthem. 
Um, it's a master plan community by Dell Webb. There's 7,144 homes in the community. There's three clubhouses, two 18 hole golf courses, over 50 clubs and groups you can join and be a part of. That's gonna be your spa, your beautiful pool here. Great functional, uh, good sized pool here. There's over 24 floor plans to choose from in this community as well of different types of homes. All of this is cool decking. So when you see a uh, decking that looks like this, it's called cool decking. And what it basically is, it's a finish they do on the deck so it doesn't get hot. So when you're out here and the sun's blaring 110 degrees, you can be barefoot on this surface and it's not gonna burn your feet. So that's gonna be cool decking. Very, very cool uh, feature that you need in Las Vegas. All right, they also have an indoor outdoor pool at the, at the Anthem Center fitness center. I mean, they have it all. Get in touch with me. I'll, I'll tell you about all the amenities of Sun City. And that's all for the bargain price of $145 a month. Yeah, outrageous. Okay, so back to the courtyard here. We're going to peek inside of this golf cart garage, which is right now a motorcycle garage. But yeah, great size, plenty of room, park your golf cart here. And it does have the garage door opener, which is rare. Most of these are just, you know, hand done. And that garage door looks brand new. That brings us to this casita. Again, $7.99 for this home with the pool, with Sun City, with the casita. It's got it all. It's absolutely beautiful. Little sink area there. Do a hot plate, you can do everything you need. All, all you really need is a little refrigerator. This is gonna be your main living area, kind of studio, apartment type situation. Then we have a full bath over here. Sink, toilet, shower. In great condition, I love this tile. 18 inch gray tile and then a walk-in closet. I mean, just absolutely wonderful. If you're looking for a pool, if you're looking for Sun City Anthem, if you're looking for Henderson, if you're looking to move to Nevada, if you're looking for a casita, if you're looking for a single story, anything you need, I got it. I'm Andrew Guyant. Give me a call. Thanks.